Okay, we are going to talk about leads, create and convert leads. So before we proceed, what are leads? Here, leads are people and companies that you have identified as potential customers. So they are not yet our customer, they are still a potential customer. So for example, in this person, maybe um, you go to Dreamforce, hopefully there is a Dreamforce 2021 next year, and you go there and you met a bunch of people that might be interested in your um, services, uh, whatever that may be, and then you talk with them, you exchange um, business cards, and then that you can enter that business card as a potential lead because uh, those people show a deep interest in your services and they say, oh, that's very interesting. We can actually use that. Yeah, we have a lot of interns um, that we recruit every year. We would like to, you know, train them. Yeah, we'd like to, we'd like to see the zone, the zone, um, intern platform hmm. yeah okay so because they are interested i would like to enter them into our system as leads so i can follow up with their deep interest and see if they want to try out our platform for free you know so that's what leads are they are not yet um, a contact that they are not yet um, a business account in our um, organization but they are potentially leads they are potential so another example what I do on um, managing a nonprofit organization we also convert leads from Facebook messenger chats so for example if I flip to my other window this is a Facebook page right and if somebody uh, goes onto this Facebook page and and chat with us and start chatting right here and then they've never been um, contacting us ever before meaning uh, they don't exist in our Salesforce um, um, database no contacts no um, accounts nothing um, I created an automation so that those chat messages um, con uh, convert into leads records in Salesforce so we can then follow up with resources and stuff and uh, ask them if we can better surface them okay so that's another example of how you can collect leads from multiple um, sources or channels like you can do it from web forms as well from chats from um, the real world like when you go to Dreamforce or, or any event and you get uh, business cards you know so you can end up them as leads uh, and follow up later on and see if they can uh, proceed trying our services and then becoming a, a, a customer in the end okay let's go ahead i'm gonna go to my hands-on org here and my playground let's use this one because we are preparing for our admin cert let's um I'm going to close this guy. Let's uh, convert a lead. So let's start by adding a, adding a lead. So Aparna Bosu, get cloudy west. So let's go ahead and add Aparna. Aparna. Uh, I'm going to go to sales here. I'm just going to copy Aparna Bosu. Aparna Bosu. So leads, you can go to the leads tab. This is a manual process, meaning uh, you've met a partner on say on Dreamforce and she wants to know more about the Zone intern platform. So let's go and add a partner here. I'm gonna click here. Um, oh, new. <laughs> I'm gonna add a partner Bosu. Cloudy West, get Cloudy West. So they're consulting firm, for example, wanting to uh, know more about the Zone Intern platform. Okay, and then what else do we have from Aparna? 
um, she's the marketing manager. I'm gonna copy that, which is the email, and then title is marketing manager. Open not contacted, right? Yes. So now, if you have more details, you can do so. You can save now. So we've just created a lead record manually, right? By a human being. I am a human being. I'm not a robot here. So you can also automate stuff like I said before through Facebook Messenger chats, through, I don't know, mobile maybe, texting. Maybe you broadcast a text message or you have an event and you say text 1234 for if you are interested to, to learn more and people are texting your short code um, numbers and that will generate leads uh, automatically, right? Or whatever through any other platform you can think of and you can convert those as lead and then follow up and, 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 and try to convert them into a contact. All right, so once the lead is created uh, for Aparna Bosu, everything else is the same, mm, more or less. You have your activity log, you can log any activity, a call, any other stuff. You can create a task for this lead event and then you can send email to this lead. And then the details is the details of the lead, what we have so far, chatter and news. And it's just the stages, okay, of the lead. You can change the stage here. So if I click there and then now it's working contacted. We've contacted um, through email. If a partner wants to follow up, up wrong. If, if she wants to follow up with our Zone intern platform or not, and then she oh yeah, let's give it a try. So we're gonna give them um, a trial service. Okay, so now let's try and convert um, convert a partner into a contact. So um, so dive into the lead record which we just did. Now we want to convert a partner. Basically, she said yeah. Um, I want to know more about the zone.io intern platform service and then we want to convert her into uh, an account and a contact, okay? Now if I hit the convert button here, so create new account and this is her name and the opportunity, um, I I can name this um, that. And I am the owner of the record. The converted status now, let's, yeah, close converted. So we are going to convert this. This will create an account for her, which is Get Cloudy West. Create a contact for her, Aparna Bosu. And an opportunity which is get cloudy west Let's tidy up a bit there so an io intern platform trial okay i'm going to convert boom and that will create three new records account contact and opportunity woohoo we're done now um close now if i go to accounts we will have get cloudy west and we have Aparna Bosu as the contact there, marketing manager. And then we also have her um, opportunity here, right? Prospecting. And then we can do more stuff. That's basically how we convert. So let's do the challenge together. I need to, oh yeah, admin search. So we have the trailhead playground correctly. So create a lead, uh, Shanta Smith. Get cloudy south. So more leads, new Chantal Smith, get cloudy south, south, and then uh, working contacted. Okay, I'm gonna go working contacted as the status here and save so Chantal is our new lead 
she is also interested in the Zone.io platform, but not for internship. She is interested for one source of login platform, which is another thing that we're going to make. <laughs> okay. So, Mr. Um, Miss Chantal Smith, um, we are going to create a task for Miss Smith and due date any day. So let's create a task here, new task. The subject is call her. Let's call her, oh, it's already the weekend. Let's call her on Tuesday. Monday is too busy. And started, not, not started yet. Yeah, it's not started. So task to call Chantal on Tuesday. Okay, that's pretty much it. So that's how we uh, work with leads. And there is many channels on how you can open the door to accept leads, like I said before, and create a bunch of automation so that you can um, work on them and convert them into contacts and accounts. All right, let's get the challenge points and I will see you on the next video, which is work your opportunities. Bada ping, bada boom. Hit that subscribe button and explore new trailhead grounds and learn to implement the most useful and popular apps on the Salesforce app exchange. And do yourself a favor, like this video and you'll be surprised on how much more you understand when watching this same video after liking it don't take my word watch this one more time after you like the video and see it for yourself bada bing bada boom